In this example, we're going to take five numbers that are written in percent form, and we're going to turn those into decimals. And this is easy as pie if you remember how to do it. And all we have to do when we rewrite a number as, when we rewrite a percentage as a decimal, all you do is just replace the percent sign with a, think about putting your decimal there, but oh, actually it's not in the correct spot. We always move it two places to the left. So 26%, I'm going to put as the decimal place as 0.26, and I'm even just going to put a zero in front. So 26% is 0 0.26. And again, the reason why we're doing that, we, we saw that we could write a percentage as a, as a fraction by just dividing it by 100. And if you divide something by 100, you in effect move the decimal place two places. But as a shortcut, that's all we're doing. So okay, 125%, uh, let's get rid of the percent, move the decimal place two spots. So it says we would get 1.25. So 125% is equivalent to 1.25. 2%. Well, it feels like there's only uh, one place to move it. Let's put some zeros in front. So if we get rid of the percentage, move it two places to the left, put our decimal sign right there, we would have 0 0.02. 1435%. 1435. Same thing. Get rid of the percentage, move it two places. That'll be 14.35. And last but not least, if we have 0.34%, same thing, we still have to move it two places to the left. So let's see, if we took the decimal place and moved it two places to the left, we would now have 0. Point, let's see, still two zeros, three, four. That would be the equivalent decimal form.